My name is Norma Darian. In this video, I will show you how to connect Google Scholar to the library's databases. If you like to use Google Scholar for research, it's very helpful to connect Google Scholar to the library's databases in order to get access to those articles that you find through Google Scholar. If you do not connect Google Scholar to the library and you find an article through Google Scholar, it may ask you to pay money for it. Please do not do that. Make sure that you are connected and if there is something that we do not have access to, you can always request it through Interlibrary Loan. In order to connect Google Scholar to our library's resources, there are a few steps you need to follow. First, go to scholar.google.com. Once you're on the Google Scholar page, on the upper left, you will see the three bars for the menu. Go ahead and click on that. Then you will go to Settings. And once you're in Settings, you will click on Library Links. In the search bar, you will type in University of Laverne and search. You will see a few options pop up. Please check those off and save. So now when you search Google Scholar, you will be able to find and access articles that are subscription only through our databases. Let's try a sample search. So as you will see on the right hand side of the screen, you now see full text at University of Laverne on a lot of these articles. If you click on an article and you are not logged into the library, it will ask you for your last name and student ID in order to access the library's resources. Google Scholar is a great search tool and it's a great tool to use if you're having trouble with some of the library's databases. It works just like a Google search, so it's a lot more intuitive. However, be aware that because it is a Google search feature, you will get thousands upon thousands of results. In this example, we found about 716,000 results versus if you search directly in a database, you will find a few thousand. So just keep that in mind. That being said, this again is a great tool as long as you connect it to the library's databases. Here's an example of an article that says full text at Laverne. So if I wanted to view this, I'll click on full text at University of Laverne. And since I am already logged into the library, it took us to one of our journals and you should have the full text here. Here's a full text PDF. If you have any questions about Google Scholar and how to use it with the library's databases, please let me know. Please email me at ndurian at laverne.edu. Thank you.